Hey guys, welcome to Pull Pin Productions, the show that teaches you filmmaking tricks. I'm your host, Matthew Grover, awesome director, sweet cinematographer, and amazing filmmaker. Today, I will be teaching you how to motion track in HitFilm 4 Express. HitFilm 4 Express is an extremely powerful video and compositing software, and I love it. They just came out with uh, 4, and I've been using it, and I have nothing but good things to say about it. Now, motion tracking is a very simple and honestly kind of boring uh, step in the video and editing process, but it is crucial. Uh, in visual effects, there's just about nothing you do without it. So today I will be showing you how to do it um, while editing my new project called Other Earth. Okay, let's get into it. So you're going to want to open up your clip. Uh, this is uh, the scene that we will be motion tracking. And your first step is you're going to want to uh, select the clip and add a new track. And what you're going to do is you're going to get this box. Basically this green box is tracking all the pixels around where you're tracking and the red box is tracking all the pixels that you actually want to track. The bigger the green and red box the more accurate your data will be but also the bigger the green and red box the more uh, uh, strain it's going to put on your computer I guess you could say not necessarily but basically you're going to want to find a very obvious point in your film um, you can see right here this light is pretty uh, pretty clear and then what you'll do is you'll just push play and let the computer do its uh, do its work and that quick okay and you can just kinda play through it uh, make sure it got everything okay then you're going to want to create a uh, new layer. You're going to want to do a point layer. And uh, you're going to want to uh, parent the track uh, that you just made to your point layer. And also you're going to want to move your point layer to where you tracked which was right there okay and then once you push apply your point will be following the track now I know what you're thinking well is that it? No. Then what you do is you find an effect that you like, whether it's fire or what I'm going to be doing, a blue plasma ball. Uh, yep. Put that on top. And you're going to want to move that over to where you want it to be and then right here you're gonna parent it to the new point and BAM it follows now I know I know this is pretty unrealistic it's supposed to be in the background and it's going over the guy well if you want to see how to mask the guy out then I will show you how to do that next week thank you for watching this video make sure you like and subscribe and remember we are pulled pin productions